Hello, hello, how are we today? Lori from Art Laura, thanks for joining me. Today we're going to do a 12 by 24 gallery wrap. I have my pillow down already. Um, and I have uh, the Multi Pro, PPG Multi Pro by, um, I get it at uh, Home Depot and I get the uh, eggshell. Love, love, love my pillow. Uh, today's colors are kind of uh, 70s inspired, kind of funky, um, couple bold ones. I'm not doing my harvest gold today. And, um, but I'm going to transfer, uh, exchange that for um, a copper. And I think uh, the colors are going to pair really, really pretty together. They're somewhat unusual for me to put together, but that's what I love um, about colors. I kind of go to my table and I just kind of open pots and I pull pots together and see what looks kind of weird. And then I put it on the canvas and sometimes it turns out. So I'm hoping today, um, that it turns out. And I think I'm, I'm pretty confident that it's going to be kind of fun and just funky. So let's get down to the canvas. We're gonna make a mess. I'll show you my colors and we'll get to blooming. Okay, so first up, light blue violet. And you know what? I think, I guess I probably should get you in, in frame here since that would be a good idea putting you in frame first. Let's put you this way just to see what happens. Are you in frame? Actually, I gotta pull you back just a pinch. There we go. All right, thank you for your patience. All right, light blue violet by Liquitex. Um, really pretty color. And I think that is, it reminds me of Periwinkle. I love Periwinkle. This one is just um, dioxazine purple, and um, that's straight out of the tube. I didn't add anything. This one here is the chroma um, copper, and that is such a pretty color. Love that color. I'm going to walk all the way around here. This is Lucas Ultramarine Blue. Beautiful, rich, deep blue. It's not like on the navy side, obviously, but it is pretty dark. Um, it's a pretty blue. Um, some of the other brands of blues, the ultramarine blues, are, they're off a shade or two. They're just different. This one here is light olive green, and um, I added a little bit of yellow because I even wanted it just a little bit more on the yellow side than the green side. This one here is uh, medium magenta, and this one is, they're all by Liquitex, except for the copper. This is medium magenta, and this is just straight out of the tube. And that's it. And then, of course, the good old cell activator, which I just made up, three to one. And uh, Magical Magical Aussie Floetrol with the Australian Oxide Black. All right, so what we're going to do, um, I think I'm going to put one right here. And I hope that color shows up. Because I do love that color. Ooh, look at those two together. That's fun. And then I'm going to add in my bronze. I think I'm just going to drizzle that on um, so that it really incorporates all through the petals. Here's this pretty blue. It's getting a little thick. Some of these paints need to go. Um, I don't like to constantly um, dilute them. Uh, we've got a massive bubble going on here. Let's just get rid of it right there. There we go. All right, here comes the beautiful yellow green. And 
last but not least is the magenta. And I think I love this magenta with this green. I think these two are going to pair very well together. I think they'll be really, really pretty. So I want um, my bloom to be more this way and this way and just a little bit off. So I'm hoping that I can keep it so that the center stays there. We shall see. All right, here we go. Cell activator. Now we're going to do medium high fan and we're going to do cool air. Okay, so I'm um, not happy with this at all. Um, I actually was looking down somewhere else, not paying attention to what I was doing, and I really hit the pillow. So um, I'm gonna do this one over. So I need to get my other spatula. I can find it. He has walked away. Oh, nope. Right in front of me. Um. <sighs> I'm thinking. I'm just going to um Yeah, I don't like it. All right, so now what I'm going to do is just kind of do this to fill in. Some of those sides there. I'm going to bring the weight back to the center. I'm going to go over that edge just a teeny bit. Bring this back and start over. Okay, 
Let's do this again. I'm just gonna add just a scant right there. Alrighty. The concept was nice, but I guess I should pay attention to what I'm doing. All right. Now all the glue. Seemed like there was a lot of blue in that one little section. And there also seemed like there was a lot of this green, which I didn't really like that. So I think I'm just going to do a tiny little dollop right there. And we'll go for the magenta though. We won't be afraid of that. Okay, let's try this again. Now, focus and pay attention. Medium high, cool air. All right, we're going to do one right there. I think the colors are quite fun though. So let's do one right here. Didn't add a whole lot of this um, dioxazine, but boy, did that come up and show through, which is wonderful. Uh, the bronze is coming up too. It's really pretty. It's incorporating quite well in the petals. So we won't be afraid of that because bronze is beautiful. I'm not seeing a whole lot of this blue, but it's peeking in here and there. So let's not be afraid to put some of that down. I think I'll just do that. And I'm glad that I did not use as much as of this. Does that really seem like a bit much? It's a bit bright. And here's my magenta. I 
Now I'm hoping to go with this one here. I would like to have the petals more so go in this fashion. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of paint right there. And we're going to have some noise. Ooh, the cells are coming up pretty there. So that looks good. Um, I think we'll just do a tiny one right there um, because I know I'm going to lose that. I know I'm going to lose it um, and that's okay. But I definitely want, um, I want color there. So because with blowing or with twi oh, I can't even talk. With spinning this out, I don't think this will come this direction enough. Um, so I think I'm just going to do a small one there. So let's just do a baby one, because we know we're going to lose it. But that'll be okay, because it'll be a pretty, it'll get pretty petals. And it will fill my corner, and that's my whole goal, is to fill the corner. All right, and we don't need a lot of this. Just a little dab will do ya right there. Cells are coming up really pretty, though. Is my pink. Okay, here we go. And again, this direction. Um, get rid of that. Okay, there we go. A little bit of noise.
Okay. I'm actually quite pleased with this color palette. I think it's really fun. So a um, couple little things. Don't like this. Get rid of that. Um, let's see. All right, so we're going to let these all come up and set up a little bit. I may have to encourage this one. Uh, this looks great. Hope it stays. May have to encourage that one a little bit. So let's just give it a couple seconds, fill up a couple corners, and we're good to go. And then we get to spin right back. Okay, we're back. And I wanted you guys to see the coolness of these cells. I'm, I'm obsessed with cells and the deconstruction and the bloom and I'm, you know, I'm kind of just obsessed with all of it. Um, so I just, I don't know, I'm just sharing my obsession. But look at these, aren't these cool? I just love them. They remind me of little pieces of coral in the ocean. Yeah. It's just really pretty. Sorry, I'm going too fast. There we go. And that's what it looks like before we spin it out. Let's hope some of this stays in place. We don't want to have to spin too much. <clears throat> Excuse me, so sorry, let me get you back in. All right, so I don't know what happened, but my phone decided to shut off uh, while I was spinning everything out. But um, you can see the results came out quite lovely. This is one orientation. I'm going to bring you down for a close-up. Uh, here's another orientation, which I think is really pretty. Um, and it could also technically go that way which i think would be really pretty i think it can go any way you want really um that is my favorite right there um i love the bloom in the center and how it's on an angle so um i'm really sorry i don't know what happened i popped you back in you were in focus and i spun when i came back to check you were gone, the phone was completely off. So um, let me take you down. We all do know what spinning is, um, but I am sorry. Um, but here is the end results, and there is the first bloom. It's really, really pretty. Here's the center bloom. Cells stayed really pretty. I love the color palette. I think it turned out great. Well, this will be a very quick video. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. That would be greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for joining me today. And again, I apologize, um, but I think for the re end results, it turned out great. I hope you all enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for joining me. See you soon. Bye.